All right, everybody, so we are going to try our next season here. I'm not even sure what the title is. There's not a name on it, just like flashy car season. But the challenge today is there's 11 flags here. I'm going to see how far I can get without having to do any redos, right? So I'm going to run every level just one time, exactly one time, get as many flags as I can, and get as far as I can in career mode this way. So let's see what we can do today. Shanghai, just one flag. We got to win the race. Okay. Now the recommended rank for a car in here is 518. I am definitely well above that, so I should be in a really good place to win this race, but we'll see how it goes. Now again, I'm only running this race once. So it doesn't matter if I do really well, it doesn't matter if I do really poorly, I'm doing it once. And whatever happens, happens. All right, so far so good. Got some good nitros, haven't wrecked myself yet. We're about a quarter of the way through the race, here we go. Nice turn there. One of the things I love about Shanghai is the streets are nice and broad. So you're not going to be hitting any walls or anything as you're making the turns now. Hitting cars, hitting bus boots, hitting all sorts of other things. Yeah, absolutely. That's that's what you want to do. You're not going to be hitting the sides because of the sides of the size of the roads, which is pretty wonderful. Right about uh, two thirds of the way through. So far, so good. Staying in the lead here again. Super overpowered relative to what's needed here, so I shouldn't have a problem. All right, 88, 89. So the finish line should be right at the corner. There it is. Boom! There we go. One flag down. One race down. Didn't even take a minute. Okay, so far so good. One race, one flag. So that means I can get to level 2 and level 3, which gives me a little bit of uh, wiggle room here as we go forward. Next is San Francisco, and again, just got to win this race. Again, recommended rank for this one is something like 538. The rank on my car is 1100, so I should have no problem outpacing these cars. Hopefully that's enough of the win. Let's see. Looks like we're going to be racing uphill in San Francisco. Trading a little paint there, that's okay. I've got my magic beamer that never loses any paint. Just rocking our way up the hill here. Avoid the cable car. Whoa, oh, that was unfriendly. Take your arms cursor if you need that head again. I'm gonna take out this cab, not great. How are these cars faster than me here? This feels a bit like a rubber band effect here, where they're going to stay close to me until the very end, just to make it feel like I'm racing some real competition, but there shouldn't be any competition in this race. The only competition should be me, myself, and I. This ramp. There we go. Shot us out ahead. Just to get into some boosting space here. There's these nice long straightaways here, which are perfect for boosting. Come on, Beamer, you can do it. Just don't hit anything on the way to first place. We'll be fine. He's going slow for a second there, so I thought he had a boost to avoid the bus. We love public transit here in our illicit racing forum. There we go. Around the semi. Finish line has to be right around the corner. There we go. Perfect. Got our flag. Right, so it's two up, two down. Now we've got San Francisco City Dash. Uh, again, we just have to win the race here. Now we do need to get all three flags in order to get to the next location. So, again, we got to win this race if we're going to continue with this series. All right, let's get a fast start here in San Francisco. Three, two, one. Here we go. City here, beautiful track. Taking us through some more scenic elements of the city. Spotting a lot of areas for central gentrification, as well as some high rise living areas down by the, the waterfront here. I do appreciate in all of these cities they've helpfully cleaned out all the people before we're racing through here, or else there could be a lot of body parts scattered across this whole level. Oh, there we go. Finish line. Boom. Did I even take 30 seconds? 38 seconds. Didn't even take 40 seconds to win that race. That was a fast race. 
All right, so we got our three flags up to section four. We have to beat the race time of 55 seconds as well as finish the race. We don't have to win. We just have to stay in it, beat the 55 seconds, and finish it. And we need both of these flags to get to the next section. So we better get this right the first time. All right, here we go. All right, off to a good strong start here. One of the things I'm getting used to here is I was just playing much multiplayer and uh, doing okay. I'm still kind of at the novice levels, but in multiplayer, all the cars just go right through each other. There's no physics between cars, <laughs> which, I mean, is great for multiplayer. You don't want to be in a situation where you're messing up the other players, but it uh, is a little bit of a mental translation whenever you're coming back to career mode where, like, you can interact with the other cars and you can crash them and they can crash them back. It's not just how you do in the race, it's how all the other cars are doing as well. Okay, so we're on pace to beat 55 seconds. Yeah, there we go, 45 seconds, and we finish the race. Both flags should take us to the next level. Boom, here we go. Okay, so five flags needed, that gets us to section five and six. Section five, all we gotta do is win this race. Here we go. All right, here we go. Continuing on our new repeats challenge. Three, two, one. Here we go, another race through Shanghai. Now again, we just have to finish this race. Or no, not finish the race. We have to win this race, not just finishing it. But uh, still fairly overpowered relative to the average car here. So we should be okay to win this. Already about a quarter of the way through the race. Coming in there pretty well. Although surprisingly, not at first. I'm not sure what these other cars are doing. They're so much better than me here. Let's see if I can put the miles on them. Now, I do have a little bit of uh, margin here where I can get to next level 6 with just the flags that I have now. But I have to win both this one and the next one in order to continue beyond that. So, we are still in the money here, but overall, got in the first place. All clear. I wasn't sure for a little bit there if I was going to make it. That wasn't too bad. All right, so up to level six, there are two flags here. 150 meters of drifting, which shouldn't be a problem, and just finished the race. Okay, so this one should be nice and easy. Thankfully, staying in Shanghai so we don't have to uh, get some new hotels or anything. And level seven is already open. So we can get to level seven, but we need 10 flags to get to level eight which means we need to win all flags in both this race and the next one. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Now again, we have to drift 150 meters in this one. And the challenge I run into with some of these races before is the race is just too, so short that it's hard to get enough drifting in with the amount of time that you have. So we've got about 100 meters of drifting in there, so we need to get like one more good drift in here. We should be okay. We're already about halfway through the race, so yeah, it was good to pay attention to drifting early. Alright, looks like there's a big turn up here so we can get a good drift there. Yeah, here's our drift. There we go. That flag is down. Now we just have to finish this race, which there's a finish line right there. Three, two, one, and done. 40 seconds, two flags down, perfect run. All right, so that takes us to level seven. Uh, again, got two flags we need to do. We need four seconds of nitro time, so we've got to be staying on top of that nitro, and we just have to finish the race. Again, we have to get both flags here, or else we cannot get to level eight. All right, here we go. Okay, again, with nitro, four seconds. We've got to focus on hitting that nitro fast and early, just to make sure that we've got enough time there get it all in here before we finish the race. Now it looks like the race is going to be reasonably long because right now we're just at 10% after getting here for a few seconds, but first let's get some nitro and hit it. There we go. All right, there we go. That's a four second nitro run. Now we just have to finish the race. Let's see if we can finish first here. I love it when I see the uh, AI cars hitting the other vehicles here. It's like, don't you see them? Can't you drive around that? Aren't you supposed to be good at this? Nope. Nope, there they are, just side-scraping everything like I am. 
Which, in its own way, is, is kind of reassuring. There we go. 45.864 seconds, two flags down. Perfect. All right, guys, we got our tokens. We got one last level up here. Uh, Pudong Rise, all we have to do is finish this race and we will get a Ferrari card and have beaten our challenge here today. Let's see if we can do the repeat challenge and win in Shanghai. Here we go. All right, one more race to go and we have to win it to get all the flags. Let's see what we can do. Now, Shanghai is one of our better areas. I love this loop here. This is such a gorgeous LED tree. Let's get off one of the cars here for now. How many chance of winning though? Just right in the middle of the scrum. All right, things have cleaned up a little bit after the jump, although I'm still not in first place. I'm about 15% of the way done though, so we've still got plenty of time to get this sorted out. I am still a bit overpowered relative to the other cars here, so hopefully I should be able to take first place, but we'll see what we can do. All right, let's get a little bit of a boost. About right, a third of the way through the race, still just in second place. Let's see if we can clean this up a bit. We are getting a little bit of mileage on the other cars here, so that's helpful. About halfway through the race here, which is great. Going to go through the park. The park is nice and open, so that should give us some room to just lay down that gas pedal and push our way through here. Yeah, that turn is always brutal. Oh, come on. How did I lose two spots here? How are they so tight on me? Alright. I gotta be cleaning up my race here. I apparently cannot uh, screw around too much on this race and still be able to win it. Alright, about three quarters of the way through. Here we go through the high rises. Alright, now we're gonna go through the underground. Let's hit the boost a little bit. Yeah, it's always tough to figure out where you're gonna do that, that drift there. Not a whole lot of visual cues. Alright, we're getting close. 90% of the way done. We've got just 10% left to go. We should be seeing that finish line here any second. There we go. Just got to boost it. Three, two, one. Woo! Won that race. And that's all she wrote, folks. 11 out of 11 season flags. Congratulations. We have completed the season in the no repeat challenge. Whew. I hope you all enjoyed this video. It was super fun making it. If you loved it, go ahead and hit that like button and please subscribe to see more great racing videos coming up soon. Talk to you soon.